Hey everyone, welcome back. Uh, tonight I'm gonna do um, a small eight by eight on canvas. Uh, if you saw my previous video about maybe three videos ago or so, something like that, um, I did a Dutch pour um, for Rinska. Um, I actually, I'm gonna do a new one. So uh, that one has been put aside. Um, and I'm gonna do another one because I didn't like um, the way the composition ended up on that one and it doesn't match um, the composition of the other two pieces I did that she has and that she likes. So I'm gonna try this one again and hopefully the composition ends up uh, the way I want it to. So, oh, look at that, I made a mess. That's interesting. So uh, colors I'm using again tonight, I'm using the same colors. Uh, which is uh, Old Gold by Artist Loft. I am using uh, Primary Blue by Liquitex Basics. I'm using Thalo Green by Americana. And I'm using a Cyan Blue by Pebeo Studio Acrylics. Uh, and so if you're curious to know how I mix my paints, uh, check out video number 63. Oh my God, I can't open this. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Uh, check out video number 63 um, that will show you how I mix my paints in these uh, six ounce bottles. So I'm going to start with my white and here is Artist Loft Acrylic Flow White with um, Floetrol. So I, I can hear Juno upstairs crying in his crate. So we had to, can you hear that? I don't know if you can hear that. We had to lock him up in his crate because he uh, can't be trusted to be left alone uh, roaming around the kitchen and family room and dining room. Uh, he is a big troublemaker. So when we're not around and he's not in our sight, he unfortunately has to stay in his crate. So it's bedtime for him anyway. He can go to sleep. So, all right, just going to get my edges here. Make sure all my edges are covered. So I just finished um, doing a live and showing you guys uh, what pieces I have for sale and stuff like that. So after that, I figured might as well come downstairs and do a few pours. So. And my buddy Lucas is here, sitting over here, watching Mama, uh, instead of being in bed, because it's, oh my God, buddy, it's almost nine o'clock. But that's okay. One week of school left, and then they're done. So whatever, I'll let them stay up. All right, so torch all the bubbles. So I'm going to start with the cyan blue. Oh, Juno, I can hear him crying, little guy. And I will do the phthalo green. Um, I'm going to add a drop of gold. And then I'll add the primary blue on top. And I'm going to add some more gold. And should I add more blue? Nah, I'll leave it. All right, so let me flood. Oh, Juno. I don't know if you guys can hear that or not. I can hear it pretty clearly. All right, so we'll flood it. I'll move these out of the way so I don't cause an accident. You must be able to hear that. <laughs> all right, I will torch it and pop all my bubbles. All right, let's see what happens this time. Hopefully I get a better composition that I'm looking for. So let's go for it. The colors on that are superb. I love these colors. So I think I'm going to just Blow a little. Just 
blow it a little over the edge there. And I'm gonna leave it. I'm not gonna blow any of the edges. So I will torch it and see what happens. There's the gold. I was wondering where the gold all went. So it just popped up right in here. So there, I'm gonna leave it. Hopefully this ends up drying like this and the composition is what, what it needs to be. So if not, then I try again. And then I'll just throw this one up on, uh, on Etsy. So I think all my edges are pretty good. Yep, they look pretty good to me. Uh, I'll bring you guys up for a close-up. Let me bring it up. Uh, no, I'll bring you down. <laughs> Let's do it this way instead. So there it is. I'm actually really loving the colors. I really like the phthalo green. It looks pretty good. So uh, there it is. Let me see if I can go closer without that shadow. Gotta love that shadow. All right, so quick video. Gosh, I think that might be one of my quickest videos yet. So there it is, put you guys back, don't drop ya. All right, let me know what you guys think of this one. There's a lot of gold in here. I like that little streaky gold in there. Let me know what you guys think. For those of you who are new and watching, um, please feel free to subscribe if you like what you see. Don't forget to hit the notification bell and that way you are notified every time I post a new video or go live. And then I have all my links to all my social medias down below. Um, so there's Pinterest, there's, I'm now on Reddit, uh, Facebook, Instagram, uh, all those social medias. So check me out on Pinterest as well. Um, and then always I have a Amazon shop now. So there is a Canadian link for the Canadians for want to shop on Amazon. And you can find all my tools that I use like the spatula, the heat gun, the torch, all that stuff. And I have a link for US Amazon. So for those of you in the US, click on the US site. And of course, as always, the PayPal link. Thank you to everyone who has donated um, in the last uh, week or so. Thank you so much. It is greatly appreciated. And that is it for now, guys. Thank you for watching this quick video and I'll be back with another one soon. Take care, bye guys.